plenty of battles waged over the Intercontinental Championship over the years between legends and absolute titans of this business. This match could easily be history in the making. He went right into that turnbuckle. Lay your chest. Knife edge chop echoing through the arena. Foot to the gut. And Gunther got turned around there. Great wherewithal on the counter. Knife edge chop. Gunther fears no man. Just rake in the face, ripping at the eyes. And there is no other term for that than just cheap, a cheap shot. Lighten up the chest and now straight to the knee. The champion is just systematically destroying the challenger here. Going to work on the leg, chopping them down as best as they know how. Tazawa is struggling to defend himself. Gunther is just doing what he pleases. And what do you think Gunther's strongest asset is in this match, Corey? You know why they call Gunther the ring general, Cole? Because he commands the match. Lean on that power and that ruthlessness to keep the match in control and beat the fight out of his opponent. Ah, for the title! And a kick out at two. He thought he had it. Off the ropes. He knew that was coming. Kick right to the back of the leg. This is quickly turning into a slugfest. So much pride, so much resiliency on display. Design rewards that attack off. And an impactful display of offense we just witnessed there. Counters, this could be an opportunity. And what a burning lariat. Into the pin attack. And the champ only gets a count of one. Getting the shoulder up before two tells me the end is not near. Look at this power. Hard to stand straight after getting taken for that kind of a ride. He heads outside, count outs legal in this match. Gunther able to steer clear. Ugh, gets put into the barricade. Gunther just continues to mount the offense. Gunther beginning to exercise his control over this match, and he may just beat the fight out of his opponent here. Ooh, what a damaging blow. And he keeps his focus on an attack to that area. Drops the knee. Oh, what impact. Oh, that's going to hurt. Cover by the champ. A close count for the challenge. You have to think this match is starting to take its toll. <laughs> Gunther doesn't just want to fight, he wants to battle. Heads out of the ring, but needs to be mindful of the referee's count here. Then a thunderous forearm to follow. Dezawa getting worked on now. Yeah, can Dezawa recover from this adversity? <laughs> Thrown back in under the ropes. Front face lock applied into an airplane spin. That's incredible. <laughs> Getting set up for something in the corner. And didn't see that boot coming. <laughs> that catches Tozawa looking. 
Ooh, the forearm connects. Just a relentless assault from Gunther. And I don't see Gunther slowing down whatsoever. Oh, using their foot. Oh, come on. And he'll leave the ring for this next stretch. Hurricane Counters that. Caught in a bad position here. What now? What now? Driven into the barricade, spine first. And gets tossed back into the mat. Plane spin off a of front face lock. Look at this power. Big time move coming up. Setting up for something here, guys. You, you don't think. You don't think. Oh, no, no, don't do it. Half and half. Oh, boy, he's stalking him. Watching for an opening. Gunther with his opponent all the way up, delivering a powerbomb. The champ will stay champ. Try as you might, you just can't get the title off. Gunther. Here is your winner, and still WWE Intercontinental Champion, a successful title defense for him tonight. He's definitely fought to keep his championship, and that's something he should be really proud of.